Guided by compassion, the Gensa Energy team, under the leadership of its Vice President, Daniel Ai, embarked on a mission to ease the burdens of these communities. Their donation was not just an act of charity, it was a symbol of their dedication to alleviating the suffering of those affected. In a heartfelt conversation with the media following the donation, Mr. Ai revealed the driving force behind their noble gesture. We heard the news of uh, the flood in Vota region and um, we thought it wise to come and then donate. Um, our board of directors and the management of Gensa Energy Ghana Limited uh, organized some funds for us to be able to purchase uh some items to come and donate as the affected communities receive this much needed support the voices of their local mps also resonate highlighting the unity and shared commitment to uplifting the spirits of victims of the floods every day you are sending food stuff and it's not something that you expect to last for more than two days and that should tell you and what is happening as a long way. In fact, we are not seeing the end yet. And so this will go a long way to help. We currently are recording close to 8,000 displaced people in South Town. And where the activities are the extra, and the numbers are increasing. I am very happy that people have brought some medications, and that will help us in the area of help. Uh, in my area, we I brought the, uh, uh, the DG, the Director General of Ghana Health Service, I brought the Pharmaceutical Society of Ghana, they brought a lot of drugs, which we have shared among the facilities in affected areas. So people are now free to go and access health care free of charge. But the education aspect is about semester, it's about terms, it's about period, and if you don't take care, we will have a lot of problems on hands. This act of kindness from Gensa Energy echoes the sentiment that in times of adversity, the human spirit can shine brighter. It's a reminder that through empathy and collective action, we can make a positive difference in the lives of those facing adversity.